Hey there, how's it going? What is up, everybody? Irish Orangutan is back to pass along what you need to know to get better at Madden and grow your Mutt team. Enjoy the show. Today we are back to talk a little bit of Mutt news going from 19 into 20 and also going to be talking about which version of Madden I'm going to be getting and which version of Madden you should be getting depending on how much you play and how in-depth you really are with the game. So the first thing that I want to talk about today is the Rookie Premier Packs refreshing. You can go out and get 20 more. I do have all of mine complete. So what I would be doing at this point is just kind of passing it on to other people. So um, we'll be looking to pass them along to people who have helped me out throughout the year. So I greatly appreciate um, all of you tuning in. Um, haven't started doing giveaways, but might start doing that going into next year a little bit after I get that exactly figured out. But just wanted to give you a little news about that and get into a little bit of the updates that they will be having in the coming week. So July 22nd, they will have details and the breakdown of X Factor and Superstar requirements and Man Ultimate Team and provide some early information on salary cap information regarding that as well. So very exciting. They are going to be bringing us three days of information. That will be the first day kind of giving us details exactly about that. Um, on the 23rd, the next day, details on Man 20 achievements per platform on Xbox, PS4, and PC for um, those who like to go out and get those accomplished. I like getting those um, knocked out kind of early in the year and then kind of sadly forget about a few of them, but you do kind of strive for those and it kind of keeps you going halfway through the year. So that is something that is a little bit interesting. And then on July 24th, we'll have details on the reward structure for following modes in Men Ultimate Team, solo battles, head-to-head -head seasons, and mutt drafts. So that is going to be exciting to see how they kind of spread the wealth to all the people who kind of are playing and play those different modes and see kind of who they value a little bit more and what they think is most difficult. But that's kind of what we have for kind of right now mutt news excited to get into a couple of other things here in just one second so uh, i just did want to talk about a couple of reasons that you potentially would like to get this game um excuse me not this game but madden 20 going into next year player updates um Players will look a little bit fresher. Everything will look a little bit better on them. I know that's not necessarily something that everyone goes out and looks for, but Camaro will look even more authentic this year as he continues to be his authentic self. Um, and also rookies will be in the game, so that is a big plus. You won't have to create all those players to get things kicked off. The second thing that I'm really excited about are the abilities that will kind of be taking the place of red chems on your ultimate team team and um, kind of getting into regs as well so that is exciting that people who don't play ultimate team will be able to kind of play with those and have a little bit more of those to work with at this point um, also better player motion real player motion came into the game in madden 19 and now they will be doing a much better job with that and kind of going into what they have already done and building upon that to try to make it a little bit better um, face of the franchise, you can go in and have that experience as yourself instead of going through um, the experience that they did have with the pre-established quarterback and wide receiver. So that is kind of exciting that you can choose your team and go about things a little bit differently and play your career. They kind of did have those things in franchise, but you couldn't play um, for college teams with your own created player and then uh, move on from there. And they will have a little bit more in-depth things that you'll be speaking with coaches and what you say will uh, impact um, how you're able to play on the field as well. And then kind of a playbook thing, they will be updating those throughout the year. They will be more in sync with your specific team that you like playing with and run pass options. RPOs will be in the game and that will be something that everyone is trying to take advantage of and find the best at the beginning of the year so that is very exciting and the thing that i'm absolutely most excited about and will be bringing out a video on 
Um, the top 10 things I'm most excited about um, for Madden Ultimate Team. I've absolutely loved the experience this year. Have went out and got all the rookie premieres. Have um, kind of flipped DeAndre Baker, um, if I could say that. Uh, but have the rest and I've been playing with them. Excited how they're going to play next year and very excited how they already have played this year but very excited to bring you news about that Madden Ultimate team and everything that can kind of bring you it is just wonderful to be able to build your team um, with the power ups that they'll be bringing back next year it has allowed you to go no money spent and just have a tremendous time playing in this mode so it's absolutely tremendous and very excited to be bringing you that video as well so getting into which Madden I'm going to be getting this year, it is not really that difficult for me to choose. I'm going to continue to go and create content. So just getting that out before I kind of go through which you should select, I am going to go and get that Ultimate Superstar Edition. Um, I'll show you why right now. Um, the Original price for regular Superstar is $79.99. Um, I do have EA access at this point, so I'll be able to play on July 25th, as you can see there as well. So I am very, very excited about that. I do have the 10% loyalty discount that is already applied, and then I will then be getting the 10% off for EA Access, getting that down to the regular Superstar price. Um, the regular price for the game, um, regular kind of price throughout the rest of the market it is $59.99 the superstar is $79.99 and ultimate superstar is $99.99 again with all of those you are able to get those um, with EA excess 10% off so that might just be worth doing if you're going to be getting the game you'll be able to play those 10 hours with the game and you'll be able to get um, whatever benefits you do decide as well with your version. Um, something I do want to point out before you do go out and purchase this game, hopefully you not have not at this point or you could potentially return it. If you have been playing diligently throughout this year, you probably have Mutt Rewards and if you have gotten to Legendary tier, you could potentially get a free version of this game. So if you are not someone who is a diehard that needs to play it three days early, you could just get the EA access, you could potentially get it for free. So make sure you're, you are checking your email for that as well. So the main thing that you really do need to consider when you are looking at the different versions of the game um, or just really do you want to play it three days early if you don't if you're more a casual person definitely just get the regular version of the game that absolutely makes the most sense it really does um, if you are getting one of the top two versions if you have the EA access and loyalty you can go out and get the superstar for a pretty decent price play three days early um, I would definitely go that route if you are um, not necessarily obsessed with the game, but definitely want to play three days early. Um, if you are an ultimate superstar kind of level, you definitely want to be um, putting out videos or talking about the game a little bit more or just absolutely to the point of being obsessed with it. So that is kind of the levels that I kind of set for those. We'll be going into a little bit more details, but if you didn't want to know all of those, that is kind of the easy way to assess yourself. If you are casual, just get standard not necessarily obsessed but you need the game three days early just go and get superstar and ultimate superstar definitely are for those people that absolutely need as much as they can to get started with the year um, we'll be playing no money spent once the game actually gets started but obviously need to spend a little bit of money on the game um, to get it so have not gotten that email from Mutt rewards quite yet hopefully that does come soon but it has not came yet so the reason that I say get Superstar if you are not necessarily obsessed with the game is that Ultimate Superstar does not necessarily come with the best bonuses in the game. It is something that is a little bit disappointing, but they definitely understand people will be shelling out a little bit of extra coin to go and get that. Um, just the incremental differences um, the first one that they kind of show are the gold team fantasy packs for the just standard version you get five the next version 12 and the ultimate superstar 15 so just getting three more and spending uh, $20 more I don't necessarily think that 
um, is that good of a bonus um, something that does separate those then after that um, are the training cell quick packs or excuse me the training quick cell packs I, I definitely did not say those in the correct order a second ago excuse me and um, so if you are getting the standard version you get none small um, comes along with a next up which is the superstar and then ultimate superstar gets a larger training quick sell pack which they would be more um, explicit with that and definitely break that down no matter which version you have one of 32 elite players so that is a huge bump and kind of a nice thing as well um, also you get a choice of one unique superstar ability to put on your player for face of the franchise so that is a huge huge bonus as well so you get to play with um, a special quarterback at the beginning of the year um, and then the last thing that kind of separates these things um, is the past and present elite player pack, which is Jalen Ramsey and Jerry Rice. That comes exclusively with the Ultimate Superstar pack. And then with the Madden Championship Series pack, you get the Ultimate... Um, you, excuse me, that comes along with the Ultimate Superstar as well. Um, that would be a coach and a few more things. Not necessarily the best thing to kind of get started with, but it is something and that is more of a cosmetic thing as well. But those really are the differences with the game. Um, GameStop does have a thing that you can go out and get the triplets. Do you want to mention that as well? Definitely won't be um, for me, but it is Troy Aikman, Emmett Smith, and also Michael Irvin as well. I believe that they have those ranged um, in the low 80s, but if you definitely want those players, go and get your pre-order from GameStop. But that is what we have for you today. I'm going to be getting that Ultimate Superstar Edition here shortly and uh, hopefully get that downloaded. Might have to uh, kick a couple things that I have been playing off, but very excited to get things started on July 25th with everybody. Going to be bringing videos up until that day to kind of get things kicked off. And very excited to continue to bring things throughout the beginning of the year. Wish you all the best and take care. Thank you for checking into the Irish Orangutan channel. Keep coming back for more Madden knowledge. That will be consistent videos up every week. So make sure to subscribe and hit the bell button to see them all. Come by Twitch to engage and hit me up on Twitter at Irish Ranting. Take care and much love everybody.